Yes or no, did you ever take banned substances to enhance your cycling performance? Yes. Yes or no, was one of those banned substances EPO? Yes. Lance Armstrong on the record finally coming clean. I'm Holland Reed in Hollywood for The Daily Buzz on CelebBuzz.com. How much legal trouble is Armstrong in store for now? Attorney and host of Investigation Discovery's Deadly Sins, Darren Kavanoki, joins me here in studio. Welcome, Darren. Thank you for having me. So, Darren, after seeing that clip, seriously, I, I want to take a look at a few more of the of the powerful yeah. yes or no questions yeah, that Oprah parts. decided to lead with. It was pretty intense right yeah. off the bat. Let's check it out. Yes or no? In all seven of your Tour de France victories, did you ever take banned substances or blood dope? Yes. So, Darren, after seeing that, at this point, what further charges or what charges could be brought against Lance Armstrong? Well, on the criminal side, let's start over there. The most serious would be perjury. He gave sworn testimony he back did. in 2005 where he said, no doping never happened. Anybody that says I did is a liar pants. Right. And now he's come out and admitted, no, he's the liar pants that, in fact, he was doping. So gotcha. that that's the big one. Now, the thing that's in his favor is there's a five-year statute of limitations. Oh. So he may be beyond that. But okay. then it gets really dicey when you bring the lawyers into the conversation. And, and this probably is more granular than anybody here cares about. But the question with then become whether or not there's a legal argument for extending that statute okay. because the government couldn't have recent uh, couldn't have reasonably discovered it. So right, it, which is what I was just going to about to ask you. To so basically, about. he lied on oath, which right. we know is is a crime. So will he right. face prison time for that, or is he going to be let off the hook because well, of time? It, it's possible. The time could help him. There's a bunch of other charges that they could bring, like conspiracy or drug distribution or embezzlement. Oh. I mean, there, there's a lot of stuff. So it really depends how big of a target the federal government wants to put on his back mm -hmm. or whether they want to leave the roadkill be. And there's good arguments on both sides. Gotcha. Okay, so the question now is, okay, with all of the legal everything that's happening, civil suits are going to be coming left and right at this guy. Yes. It, how is, what do you think is going to happen with that? Are people going to be lined out of the courthouse, like waiting yeah. for their check in hand or what's going on? Well, maybe. I mean, the, the initial reaction is, Lance, get ready to write a check for mm. about a zillion dollars, right? Because <laughs> right. everybody right. is going to be coming out and they're going to be wanting their money back and that's from civil lawsuits. Yeah. So we're talking about people like the people that put up the money, the prize money for the Tour de France. Right. All the people who he he went after, and he actually sued people, and they talked about it during the interview, he went after people that said he doped. Now all of those people could potentially so, sue him. No, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off, but, but quickly, so, so with all of that being said, what is the biggest hurdle, do you think, legally, that he's going to be facing at this time? Well, it, the, the biggest hurdle is people lining up to sue him, right. taking depositions, and now trying to impeach him if they can, you know, they can make him out to be a liar very easily. From a practical standpoint, mm -hmm. though, all of those people that are potential plaintiffs may actually not want to sue. When all of the dust settles on this, they may not want to risk the money, the aggravation, and putting their reputations at stake. You know, so. it just, it seems like literally this is just the beginning of a huge mess. Started I thank you here. so much for coming and joining thank us and shedding a little legal, legal light on you this bet. story. And tune in uh, for part two of the Lance Armstrong Oprah event tonight on OWN's Next Chapter. And for the latest news in Hollywood, stay clicked on CelebBuzz.com.